Hi, I'm Captain Brian Arruda from the New Bedford Fire Department, also the coordinator of the uh, Student Awareness of Fire Education Program. I'm here at the New Bedford Fire Museum for the uh, 2015 Open House. This year's Fire Prevention Week theme is Hear the Beep, Keep a Smoke Alarm Where, where You Sleep. So it's very important that uh, your smoke alarms are working and that your smoke alarms are in the proper place, which would be outside your door, and we also recommend that uh, you should keep a smoke alarm inside your bedroom here also. This year we're having the uh, open house at the New Bedford Fire Museum at 51 Bedford Street. I'm here with the uh, founder and curator, retired firefighter Larry Roy from Station 8. When did you retire, Larry? Uh, 2000. Year January, 2000. January 2000. January 2000. Uh, Larry's been doing this is what the 40th year, Larry? Yeah, about 40 years. 40 years 40th, and uh, anniversary uh, next year. Okay, and maybe Larry would like to. Uh, there's a, a lot of antique uh, fire apparatus here. Maybe Larry would like to tell us about it. Uh, show us about what we have here. Yeah, we are uh, in this room here. This is the original fire station uh, that was opened in 1867. We have over here is a steam engine, fully restored. From, uh, that was delivered here in, in 1884. Pictures you see on the wall here are all the uh, firefighters that were here back then. And uh, they went to a, a big fire in, uh, in Boston in November of uh, 1872. Uh, big conflagration burned uh, 80 acres of land and it was a year after the, uh, the uh, Great Fire, Chicago Fire in uh, 1871 which uh, is one of the reasons they, they, uh, they do this in uh, October, Fire Prevention Week, because of that fire. Uh, let's go upstairs and we can see what the, uh, how the firefighters used to live back in the 1800s. And funny enough, we still have the same, uh, the same furniture in the stations that are working today that they had in the 1800s. So let's take a walk upstairs. The um, dormitory, and it goes, dates back to, uh, I would say, around uh, 1918 when they, um, they uh, <coughs> dispersed of the volunteer firemen and uh, the station became a permanent fire station. And they had these same beds here uh, where they would uh, get up in the middle of the night to uh, respond to fires. Larry, I just noticed this uh, lantern over here. It says Onward One. Can you tell uh, our viewers and the rest of the citizens what Onward One stood for and why that all came about? Yeah, well, uh, Onward One was the first um, steam fire engine to uh, come to the city of New Bedford in uh, 1859. They had, before that, they had been using hand pumpers, and uh, due to a uh, <coughs> gigantic fire in 1859, they finally voted in to get a uh, steam engine for the city, and it was called Onward One. And I was stationed on uh, Purchase and Franklin Street. And that lantern that you see here, over here, was uh, on the top of uh, the first steam engine that arrived in the city. And it was donated to the fire museum. Okay, so that's been a real quick tour of the Bedford Fire Museum. I want to thank uh, Larry Roy for taking us through. Uh, if you, if anybody in the community, community organizations need a fire safety uh, presentation, if you turn around here, this, here's part of our educators standing around over here. 
Uh, you can contact myself. I'm Captain Brian Arruda, New Bedford Fire Department. The best way to contact me is by email, and that would be braruda at newbedford-ma.gov. So that's B-A-R-R-U-D-A at newbedford-ma.gov. And uh, thank you very much for uh, tuning in, and uh, hope to see you at the Fire Museum, and have a good day.